Hey y'all. So I just filmed a video and I'm kind of just sitting here putting away some of my makeup. I bought some more stuff. I know I just did haul week and I'm still buying, but I bought a few more things, but y'all promise after this, I, I'm done. I gotta be done. Mark said he gonna divorce me if I ever buy that much makeup at one time again. <laughs> so I gotta be done for real. But um, no, I'm just sitting here um, putting away some makeup and I wanted to swatch some stuff for you guys. And um, I'll show you guys some of the stuff that I got. I can't even pick this box up. I got some more stuff on the way, but um, I'll show you guys some of the stuff I got, but I wanted to swatch something in particular for you guys because it came in today. So, eek. my Sephora Pro Palette actually came in, not today, but it was a couple of days ago actually. But this is the palette, the $68 palette that I can't believe I paid $68 for this Sephora Pro Palette, but when it's upside down. When I opened it up, I understand where the $68 went. Because this is just... This is just beauty. Like, beauty, beauty, beauty. Can you guys see that? That is beautiful. So, the only thing I don't like about it off the bat is that the names are not printed on the palette, actually. They have this little, like, overlay. I hate those. But, just look at the shades. Ooh, and look at that huge mirror but look at the shades so such a gorgeous palette I mean oh my god so I'm gonna swatch a few of the shades for you the first one I'm interested in is always a black so we're gonna swatch this I can't even hold it and swatch it oh look at that that's a black let's get one of these shimmers oh Oh my God, y'all. Let's do a peach shade. Peach shimmer. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, that one's a little sheer. That's this peach shimmer right here. That one, oops, sorry, y'all. That one is super duper sheer. That one is super duper sheer. Here's a crease color. That looks really good. That one was a little powdery, but still looks beautiful. Camel color. That one swatched really beautiful and soft. I mean, it looks pretty good. So maybe I'll get a look done with it this weekend. Um, I actually just finished filming another video for you guys but maybe i'll get a look together with it this weekend i didn't know if i actually wanted to do a whole nother haul video since i literally just did six in the last month i feel like that's a little like haul overkill so i might just show these products throughout my vlogs over the next several weeks i don't know we'll see but that is the sephora pro palette i did get that so i'm really excited to start playing in that and then I also picked up some NARS lippies. Like, oh, I got two NARS lippies. I got one in Rock With You. This is their new, Pama, what is it called? Power Matte Lip Pigment. So this one is in Rock With You. And it's like a raspberry. Ooh, that's a really like precise doe foot. Like, look at that. That is a super precise doe foot applicator. So I kind of like that. Not the best for swatching, but we're not getting them to swatch them, right? We're getting them to put them on our lips. This one is in Slow Ride. Slow Ride. Why did I just do that? I don't know. But it's like a peachy brown. Ooh. It's a different color brown. It's like a peachy color. So I did get those two as well. I might as well just show y'all most of these products, right? Um, I got a primer from Peter Thomas Roth. This is the Skin to Die For No Filter Mattifying Primer and Complexion Perfector. So I did pick that up from Ulta. I think this is actually pretty new at Ulta. 
because I've never seen it. But I was just browsing their website and I went ahead and saw that and so I went ahead and picked it up. I finally picked up this foundation. I see so many people talking about it so I'm definitely ready to see what the hype is all about. I done snuck a haul in here anyway, y'all. I also got two more things from Black Opal. This is the Invisible Oil Blocking Mattifier. And this was like $10.95. So it's a little pricey for drugstore. And it's like in this little ass tube. And I was like, it ain't bigger than this. But this is what they gave me. So that's what was in the damn box. I was expecting it to be this size for $10.95. But excuse my henny. I'm grown. Anyway, I also got the Black Opal True Color Pore Perfecting Powder Foundation. I got that in the shade Truly Topaz as well. So I'm interested to see how that works along with the foundation, with the liquid foundation. Oh, two things from Pixi. I got their Glow Tonic. I've been wanting to try this for years and years and years and just never got around to it. So I finally went ahead and picked that up. And then I also picked up their Makeup Fixing Mist with Rose Water and Green Tea. So I think this is new, so I just wanted to give it a little try. So I used this Glam Glow Glow Setter Makeup Setting Spray. And like it's like a dewy, luminous setting spray. And I just, I don't think I'm going to be able to wear this out the house, like outside of videos. Because that's pretty damn dewy. What else I get? Oh, a few things. I got this NYX Cleansing Balm. This is supposed to be a dupe for the Clinique Take the Day Off Balm, I think. But this is like half the price and it's more than double the size. Can I open it? There we go. That was on there tight. But yeah, it's half the price and more than double the damn size of that Clinique. So I'm not going to open it right now. But I'm interested to see um, exactly how this works because... This is said to be a dupe for that. All right, keeping, what else I got here? I think I'm gonna save some of this for tomorrow cause I don't know, I just am. I'm gonna save some of it for tomorrow. I don't need to do the whole thing today, but there's still a bunch of stuff in that box. So I showed y'all a lot of it. I'm trying to do some makeup organizing y'all. Um, I got so much stuff. I am so excited to try this. The Black Opal True Color Pore Perfecting Foundation. I have heard nothing but amazing things about that. So I'm super excited to try that. Like super excited. So this is probably going to my next shop, my stash for real. Not the next one because I've already filmed that, but the one after. Hello. Hubby's home. I told y'all he was on his way home. Hey, we're vlogging. Okay. You want to say hi? No, not really. Well, you can, because you're here. No, that's not how you got to show your face. Show your face. Show your face. I don't feel like bumping bend it down. So what? Fine. Whatever. But yeah, I'm so excited. I've heard nothing but good things about this. So, really excited. I have, y'all should see my desk, hold on. Well, my vanity, I should say. Like, I'm trying to get a good organization. Oh, excuse my drink. I'm trying to get a good organization system here, but oh my God, I need to get a good organization system before I do a makeup collection video. Cause y'all been asking like crazy for me to do a makeup collection video and my stuff is not organized. Like I really want to organize it really well and I just can't seem to find the best organization system. And then I feel like I'm gonna find that organization system and we're gonna move. Like y'all know we in the market for a house. So I'm gonna find that organization system in a couple months. It's gonna be like, oh, time to move. So then I had to find a whole nother one. <laughs> So, um, I guess I'll just find a good one for the time being, but I'm trying to get as organized as possible and trying to lay my makeup out as much as possible so I know what I have and I can see it and I can use it, you know what I mean? But, alright, so, hubby's home. So, I guess I'm going to call it a night. Oh, my glow is on point. I am using, what am I using? The Anastasia Beverly Hills Illuminator in Riviera. This is one of my absolute 
favorite highlighters. I'm using that and I am like glowing, glowing, glowing. Can keep all this on for later? No. Why not? You can just keep this on. My face gonna break out. I said this. My lips gonna break out. <laughs> He come in making demands. Not making demands, making I say make a request. That's a request. I could, a demand is need to keep that lipstick on. That's a demand. Keep it on for what? That's inappropriate. <laughs> on my face, I'm actually wearing a Smashbox Studio Skin Shaping Foundation. Y'all, it's actually holding up pretty well. I've had it on for like three hours. It's actually holding up really, really good. I really like it right now. Like, really like it. So, I'll keep y'all posted on this. I feel like I'm rambling because I've had a few drinks. So, I'm going to let y'all go. And... Sure, that's the same reason why I said you can get your nails done. That's why you say keep your lipstick on. <laughs> you say I can keep... First off, you say I can keep my nails done. I said get your nails done. Whatever. Okay. Same reason why you get your nails done. Whatever. I don't. So yeah. Um this is moving from PG to rated R. So I'ma go ahead and let y'all go tonight and then I will see y'all tomorrow on Saturday. I actually have a baby shower. My sister in law, Mark's sister. Um, is having a baby. She's pregnant. So I try to vlog a little bit at her baby shower. It's tomorrow. And I don't know. I'll try to film another video. I'm going to film some more videos for you guys. I'm going to, I don't really have any errands to run tomorrow. Probably go grocery shopping on Sunday. So maybe I'll try to do a quick grocery haul. And I think that's it. All right. Bye. Hey guys. So... It is like 1.30 ish, no it's 2 o'clock, I'm sorry, on Saturday and I am on my way to pick up some food for myself and the kids because we have my sister-in-law's baby shower to go to. So once I'm done getting the food then I'll get back and I'll get us all ready to go to that. But I'm just going to pick up some food from this chicken spot. I know I'm on my, on my during my fitness challenge, I know that, but uh, yeah, I'm just picking up some food, okay? <laughs> I know I'm during the challenge. I'm just, I, I don't know. I had a little craving for a catfish sandwich, so that's what I got myself. And I got the kids some chicken and some french fries. I should have just took Lakeshore. That's what I'll do because it's probably quicker. But yeah, I got to hurry up and get home and get them fed. And then put the girls in the tub and get the boy ready so we can get out and get to this baby shower and I have to also get ready myself because I have to find something to wear and see what I'm wearing for this it is like so hot outside and I got this jacket on because I'm like not dressed appropriately so it's like super hot outside and I'm dressed like a ratchet so I threw on a little jacket but I'm burning up Lord. But anyway, yeah, today should be, I guess after we go to that baby shower, today should be a chill day. Not really doing much. Don't have anything planned for later. We ain't got no babysitter tonight, so ain't no, um, ain't no date night tonight. Kind of salty. Well, not salty. I'm happy for them. But my little sisters start college this week. Um, if you guys didn't know, I have twin 17-year-old sisters and, um. We'll also have an, a 19 year old sister and then also a 20, what is she, 27 year old sister? So I have a lot of sisters. But anyway, the twin 17 year old sisters actually start college this week. So one of them um, is moving in today and the other one moves in on Tuesday. And I'm so incredibly happy and proud of them. I am just a little salty because those are my babysitters, y'all. Like, <laughs> especially the one of them, that's my nanny. Like, she was, she helped us out so, so much over the last three and a half years having kids. Like, oh my gosh, she helped us out so much. So now she's gone. So I'm like, we don't have to like, oh, found us another babysitter. My other sister, she's 19. She's still at home and she helps out from time to time. But I'm like, we don't have to find us another babysitter. She was part of the reason that we was able to go out so much and do as much as we did. Now she's going off to college. I'm like, 
hell we gonna do but we are going somewhere next weekend we actually have a boat trip planned um we rented a yacht with my cousins and some friends and we're actually gonna be out on a boat so that's gonna be fun that's gonna be nice i definitely vlog that but that should be a lot a lot of fun and oh you're just gonna go anyway huh i think i might get the kids some ice cream too they'll like that since they're about to get in the tub anyway all right y'all but that's it i'm gonna pick up this food and um yeah i'll see y'all later no. Who like makeup? Me. Morgan? No, I have to go I know. Raya, what store you want to go to? Uh, the makeup store. Y'all are here? I want to go to the supermarket. One want to go to the supermarket, one want to go to the makeup store. We like the supermarket. Raya likes the makeup store. I like the Don't you, Beans? Supermarket. Oh, no, go to the makeup store and get makeup. <laughs> Do you? No. Daddy, can you know where my window down? Yes. Can so, I have a down? bag of makeup that um, I just decluttered. Y'all know y'all see my declutter series. I have a bag of makeup that I just decluttered. So, we're about to go back home and grab that so I can and give it to my mother and my sister in law. And, um, also cousin that's over there Mommy and, Wendy. and they can have Mommy. all of that i'm trying to get all that makeup out of my house like it's just way too much you gonna buy more and get, get keep buying shit so because i like to buy makeup I like to blow money whatever she's got that shit's coming out of her ass <laughs> makeup makes me happy but daddy not giving away it don't make well, me happy go i gotta stop and get something for your mother so, yeah, we about to be on our way there. Isn't that brown bag? Yeah. I think it's an Ugg bag. Um, so, yeah, we about to be on our way there. And um, we're just going to hang out for a bit. I'm just going to hang out for a bit. If they don't mind, I'll turn the camera on for a little bit. And um, as I'm kicking somebody's ass in spades, I don't know. But I'll see y'all when we get there. Peace. What is that? That's no, he's not. No, he's not. <laughs> Snapchat. She thinks she on Snapchat. This is Lazy Sunday. 
and it's about it's about, about noon. We skipped church. I feel awful. But we skipped church and we are just kind of laying around and doing some housework also. Um, trying to get some things done. Trying to get some things done. Watching TV, folding clothes. Ain't that right? What you got planned for today? <laughs> what? Okay, go sleep. Ew, is that how you sleep? Snapchat. <laughs> Silly. So yeah, we're just kinda hanging out around the house. Um what? You thirsty. Maybe I will show you guys like um one of my healthy meals that I prepare. I might go grocery shopping today. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen today. I know I need to film a couple videos. Um, so we'll see. I don't know what's gonna happen today. But I will keep you guys posted. Get out your mouth. What? Hot chocolate! What? What I can eat it is drinking in September. You want to tell me why they need hot chocolate in September? Or October or November or December. It don't go bad. It'll be okay. okay. Don't y'all want hot chocolate? What do you mean no? You want hot chocolate beans? I know beans want hot chocolate. Ew! Get your girl that yogurt on it. Her chip. I know. She a mess as usual. Um, beans. Messy, drink, messy ride. There's no need to drink hot chocolate in the summertime, okay? Say so it's either hot chocolate or coffee. You want hot chocolate or you want coffee? No coffee either. I want hot chocolate. No, See? Coffee. What do you want, Raya? Hot chocolate or coffee? Yeah, do you want to be hot? hot chocolate. You're already hot in the summertime. You don't I want hot chocolate. You do? So this is just a little Daddy, grocery haul for you guys. Do you down there? Haul is just when you buy stuff. Mommy? What? Haul is just when you buy stuff. Daddy, can you what? That? What I bought? Can you yeah. get that animal root down there? What do you mean? Just one of them. You didn't know what a haul was? I just always hear you talking about this kind of haul or that kind of haul. No, you don't. Yes, you do. Yes, I do. All the time. I just had. Yes, I just had a haul week. No. Yeah, I hear you say that. Come on. So my ultra haul or my this haul. Or yeah, that's just you showing what you bought. But other than that, I grabbed some hot chocolate for the children. For the Keurig. And it's for the Keurig too. This shit probably like five dollars. It was two dollars because it's only a three pack. Calm down. Three packs of hot chocolate. It was two dollars. You can get a whole twelve pack for two dollars. You be quiet. I also got That's a. That's some lazy shit right there. They like the Keurig. They like seeing it. I also got the okay, forty-eight you can put count. Some water in there. Oh my God! Can I finish you this? Can, I'm just saying you can put some water in the Keurig and let that shit drip out, and they'll be just as excited. Y'all have to spend three dollars on some hot chocolate. I said two dollars. Okay, you have to spend two dollars on some hot chocolate. Like, you could have got, got a twelve pack, get some coffee filters, put that shit in the Keurig, and they would have been just as happy. Get that ass right there. What do you want? What is that? Chocolate cookie. There ain't no chocolate cookie. Chocolate. It's hot chocolate. Hot chocolate. You can have some later, okay? Okay. All right, go ahead. Go to the living room. All right, so I also grabbed a 48 count, 100% um, Arabica Colombian coffee, great value brand. It was like 15 bucks, so I got that for work. Of course, you need wine when you're dealing with this. So I got a, what is this? Gallo sweet pineapple, which is really really good, and then I also got this Jamaican reggae red. This stuff is really 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 good. Um, got some fit kitchens, hubby really loves fit kitchens, and I eat them from time to time as well. But I've been trying to cook a little more, so we got three of the oven roasted chickens, and then I got this one for myself, and it is the Monterey chicken. And they're really just pre made meals, they're low on calorie, but it's like a real a lot of food, so 
it's really cool the sodium is kind of high though so I don't like that I also grabbed some strawberries some mint leaves for my water some romaine lettuce lemons asparagus salmon and chicken so that is what I got hey y'all so I'm sitting here drinking a little wine and um I thought I would show you guys the stuff that I couldn't show you guys earlier because my camera cut off and then um I got some other stuff in yesterday and it was at my mom's house and I went ahead and went and got it so I thought I would show you guys that too and so let's just get started so the first thing is this is what I couldn't show you earlier this is that new limited edition wet and wild highlighter it's from their fall collection and then I also got the one of the liquid lipsticks and this is one of their metallic metallic liquid lipsticks in harbor a crush so i just got these two i think i might be giving this one away as a giveaway so we'll see but i will be wearing this one in an upcoming oh matches my hair i'm gonna have to rock this yeah then i got some more things from ikhouse.com and um i just grabbed another la girl pro concealer and also an la girl matte liquid matte lipstick it's not liquid lipstick it's just a lipstick and i got that in the shade blue blue valentine i got a blue lipstick i did maybe i thought it was purple Ooh, i'm gonna have to try that soon then i also got a few things from cara cosmetics cara beauty i'm sorry and i got two of their brushes which they look totally identical but one is supposed to be the highlighting brush and then the other one is supposed to be the blush brush but they look super identical to me and then I grabbed this palette right here I absolutely hate these palettes because I never seem to use them that much however when I looked at it online I was like this looks like a total dupe for the Anastasia Beverly Hills subculture palette and I can't remember if I told you guys but I did take that subculture palette back well send it back um I just decided I wasn't going to use it not that I didn't like it I thought the colors were dope I thought the palette was fine but I sent it back because I just really didn't need it so I went ahead and purchased this one and it looks like a total dupe for that palette and I think this was like $11 or so but I was like swatching it a little bit earlier it's not as pigmented but the pigmentation is still there you know what I mean like look at that like you don't need something that's ridiculously ridiculously pigmented like this is still a pretty pigmented palette uh it doesn't swatch the greatest I guess but I guess we'll see it on my eyes I'll try to do a look with this to show you guys but I don't know I I like that so I'm gonna keep playing with that but that is it that's all the stuff that I got there will not be any more hauls for me for a while you guys I swear to you I just I have too much stuff and I'm going to be doing a lot of reviews, a lot of tutorials, a lot of first impressions, all of that because I just, it's too much stuff. But yeah, that's what I got. Oh, I also got some shower caps too. But I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this vlog. It is, blog, blog. It is Sunday evening. It's about 9 o'clock, 9.30. It's 8.50. So... 8.50 on Sunday evening. I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Also, let me know if you guys are liking these weekend vlogs. I am going to try to do them a little more consistently. Maybe one vlog a week. I'm going to try it. I am slowly getting used to vlogging. So, give me a little time to get a little better at it. But, um, yeah. I'll try to get one up once a week for you guys if you like it. So, let me know down below what you think about the vlogs. Bye, guys.